I'd like to show you very quickly how we can utilize drive image to create workflows that will greatly increase your daily productivity now in our case we are a copier provider so as you see I have a workflow here created for adding a lease now what this will basically allow me to do is when a user wishes to add a lease into our into our database we can actually prompt them to enter information that will allow us to retrieve this documentation quicker should we wish to as an example if I click the profile you will see what I'm actually asking the user is to select an existing customer or create a new client and then enter a lease number now the way this will actually work is that they will either select an existing or create a new client which will then in turn create a folder or in the case of select an existing customer locate a folder for that client so in effect you're finding a location to save the document and then when you enter the lease number I have it set so that the file name is the lease number that is entered plus the date so you'll have immediately the lease number and the date now I also have an if statement created in here which helps everything work together so that when it's when it runs it is seamless now if I were to run the demonstration for example I can just run a demo through the web page you will see we have a prompt on the panel here this is exactly as the user sees the panel on the copier they can add a lease so if they click add a lease they're asked to select an existing customer create a new client and enter a lease number so in this case I will create a new client and I will call it test client and hit OK and then I will enter a lease number and let's say I want to enter the lease number one two three four five now again this uses the touch panel on the copier so there really is no no issues at all with typing things in we hit OK and now as you see we have a test client and we have a lease number so I will hit scan I can choose my options let's say I'll do it in color high quality and I'll do it in duplex because I want to scan something and then I just hit scan now this is a test so it's creating a it's creating a virtual document for me so I can hit finish and then close the web page back down now everything's being saved into the folder you see here titled drive demo so what I can do is double click this folder and as you will see I have a folder titled lease this is basically my storage location where the documents are being saved into and within the lease as you see I have the test client that I just created and then I have my lease number 12345 and today's date and within that file I would have the scanned image now to show you just how quickly these profiles can be set up I'm going to create a profile that will actually let us retrieve the document so let me hit add and I will say I'm going to create it on the embedded device and I'm going to say print a lease it's going to be a printer type and then hit OK now what I'm going to do here is add a new field so I'm going to say print a lease and make input input mandatory hit OK so what that will then do I can select my folder so I'm going to select drive demo and lease which is the root folder where I'm saving into and then very simply hit save so what that will now do if I go back to my virtual panel as you see I have an option to now print a lease so not only can I scan things in but I can also retrieve documents through the copier as well so if I hit print a lease you'll see I have my test client so I can very easily go in select the document and then hit OK and now I have the selection and if I hit print it will ask me how many copies very simply I'll say one and hit print what that will now do send the document to the copier to print very simple very quick and very productive if you need to file and retrieve documents quickly